Are you a brave speaker? You look like one. Hmm. And sound like two. Seeds will grow up with the kiss of raindrop. So does hope. Be quiet, my old pal. You always let me hear everything. Clearly. <sighs> I'm not good at dealing with visitors. It reminds me of something bad. I brought you a flower. Go find it in the woodpecker house by the street. The darkness swallows the sun. The starlight quietly leaks out of its belly. Wearing headphones for too long will give you a headache. Don't be surprised, everyone has had it. Although we seem poker-faced and indifferent. I don't recommend you read those reports. Firstly, it's really boring. And secondly, the Stasi may find you. Someone once hung himself on the tree to scratch his back. Of course, he didn't know it was me who called help for him. Do you know where you can see flowers? In a parterre or in a garden? Neither, my friend. You should go under the bridge where even a tramp will find it too dirty to spend a night. Only on the mud-coated walls of the aperture can you see the most beautiful cornflowers. Graffiti. At least for once, I want to check up on the kids on the other side of the monitor. Well, we've never met in person, but they are already my old acquaintances. Shall I ask the enemy for their tactics? Finally, some interesting work. Shh, I hear something. Whose heart is beating so loud? For tomorrow. We should listen to what people say. Radio waves are everywhere. Everywhere. Agents have guns. It's called common sense. Talking out calms people down. Don't be so furious. Secrets always hide in careless words. Listen carefully. Hey, I'm the support staff. Retreat! What? I can't make the call? Stay low profile. I don't want to be shunted to the secret police department. 